Max Clark writes, hey, how come Tom Cruise hasn't been typecast as Ethan Hunt in the same way Daniel Radcliffe has been as Harry Potter? Uh, well, one of the main reasons is because Tom Cruise was already a big, major, established star. Yeah. I mean, before he ever did the first Mission Impossible, he did Taps, The Outsiders, Risky Business, All the Right Moves, Legend, Top Gun, Color of Money, Cocktail, Rain Man, Born on the Fourth of July, Days of Thunder, Far, Far Away, Few Good Men, The Firm, The Interview with the Vampire. These are all before yeah. he ever did the first one. And to be honest with you, when people hear Tom Cruise even now, nobody thinks Ethan Hunt. Right. I mean, we think of him in a million different ways. I think of him as like platinum level, like executive club action yeah. star. I'm curious like, how old the anything. viewer was who wrote the email. Because he, to him, that might be the first thing he ever saw. Yeah. So right. maybe sure. that's why. But even since then, Magnolia, Eyes Wide Shut, Vanilla sure. Sky, Minority Report, Last yeah. Samurai, Collateral, Absolutely, World but, Worlds. Absolutely. But, and we don't, know, we don't know from what Daniel Radcliffe is going to do from here on. He might be in a ton of movies. But the difference is with this guy, who, if, he's, if he's younger, who, who wrote it, it was the first thing he ever saw him. And he associated him as Ethan yeah, I sure. get it. Because yeah. for me, I associate Harry, Daniel Radcliffe as Harry Potter. Because that's I've watched a kid grow up as Harry Potter. Now Emma Emma Watson. Yeah, um, she's broken out. More. She's broken out more, and she yeah. will eventually maybe do another role that you go, oh, that's that's so and so now. It's not even Hermione. Mm. So we just it's just a matter. Of, Tom Cruise has is a different type of movie star though. He's Tom yeah. Cruise and everything he it's does because he's, he's, he's I don't even remember movie. what his character names are in any of the <laughs> You're movies. You're like Tom Cruise. Yeah, Tom Cruise. The, the, <laughs> and when the Tom Cruise character did this, what's his like, name in Jack Reacher? No. Also, the other yeah. the other thing is Justin, that Daniel Radcliffe is is younger by a, by a many many years. So Tom Cruise has all these years yeah. of experience. To your point, when you're reading off all those titles, like Tom Cruise has been working since the early early '80s, so he's got a lot of time on Daniel Radcliffe. Mm -hmm. So well, we'll and see. with Radcliffe, with like you're saying, watching grow up, it's the only thing people know him from. Yeah. We were it's introduced early. to him as. Harry Potter, and then that's all he was for like eight years. Was yeah, he's Harry in a couple. Potter. He's yeah. in so, I mean, Ricky Gervais, uh, uh, you know, series, an episode, yeah. and, and, one one and also the, one the fact that Harry Potter was uh, these books were beloved and so popular. Yeah. And when you're playing this character that people have already in, in their head going, "Oh, I wonder what that looks like," and then it's him. Mission Impossible was based off of the, the series, and it, it's not it's not the same phenomenon right. that Harry Potter no, was. No, no. So that's a two not that's two all. different things. So. So when Horns comes out, I'm sure they're going to be like, I wonder what Harry Potter is going to be like in Horns. <laughs> it's going to take a little bit of while to get rid of that. You know. Hey, everyone. If you like this video, click that thumbs up button and make sure to subscribe to our AMC Movie News YouTube channel. It's free and helps you stay up to date with all the latest movie news, as well as our daily AMC Movie Talk Show. Also, make sure that you follow us on Facebook and Twitter to stay up to date with all of our special promotions, contests, and prize giveaways.